Welcome to another episode of Bacon Pokey Dad. Pokey Dad here, and welcome to our first ever episode of something new, something old, and something to celebrate. We promised this months ago to do this kind of series. We're going to do it once a week. We've got something new, which is this brand new pencil case tin. You get two packs inside, and you get a nice little organizer for your pens and pencils but the main reason I got this and the reason I picked it up I thought it would be a great way to store Bay Kids pins the actual pins not pins you write with so put some foam in there maybe we can put some it'd be like his own little pokey badge kind of collector case so that's kind of cool there we got that of course we got the five packs of celebrations we're still looking for that Rayquaza and then something old we got a Gardevoir tin from about three years ago, I believe, we picked. I picked it up. Actually, I picked up this exact tin probably two and a half years ago, and it's just been sitting. So we're going to open up everything up. Of course, something new goes first, something old, and then we'll finish with the celebrations at the end. Something to celebrate. Hopefully, we can celebrate with an awesome Rayquaza pull, because we have yet to pull the Rayquaza, you guys. Let's just rip this open. Boom. So I caught my eye and I thought this was awesome. It looks kind of cool to open up. I figured you guys would enjoy it. What do we got here? Ooh, Astral Radiance and an Evolving Sky. So, see, this is what I wanted here. These are a few of my pins here, but I really want to get some foam in there. And look how you can put the, you can probably stick them in flat so it sits nice and neat. And you can probably get four, you can probably get eight to ten pins in there. So that was the main reason behind that, you guys. Hopefully I can do that. Maybe I'll do a quick video on it some other day. So first two packs, the new packs, Astral Radiance and Evolving Skies. We'll start with the Evolving Skies. Let's do this. Of course, Evolving Skies had started these amazing run on alternate arts that Pokemon started coming out with. Let's see if we can pull one of those today. That'd be kind of nice, right? We have a Dark Energy to start it off with a Vigoroth. Lombre. Fletchender, Nicket, Sableye, Applin of my eye, Cutie Fly, Time Pole, a Reverse Braviary, and a Sharpedo Non Holographic. All right, so barely anything there from Evolving Skies. Let's get into that Astral Radiance. Of course, we did finally do an Astral Radiance opening, you guys. If you have yet to check it out, make sure you do. I will link it in the description. As well as put it in the eye in the sky. Feel free to click on that and then come back to this video to finish it off. First code card from Astral Radiance. Let's see if we get anything else from Astral Radiance. I actually like the set. I know it's uh, kind of hard coming off a set like Brilliant Stars. That was a great set. So having to run up against that with Astral Radiance is kind of hard. Tokopi with the Tokotic. Magnemite. We got a Ralts. Sneasel. Mystery of... We got a Reggie Drago, Reggie Drago, Reverse Rare, and a Hollow Keldio. Very nice. All right, so we got two rares there from the Astral Radiance set. Very nice. That's a good way to kick it off. We'll go there. That's all right, you guys. That's a good start. Good start. All right, let's use one of these pins over here. And let's not use the Eevee. This has got too many. We'll grab that Charizard pin. Now let's pop open these guys, I believe. Let's see, take a quick look. There are three, only three packs in this. You get a foil card with it, which is the Gardevoir or the Blissey. Now we did have, I think I still have the Blissey tin somewhere. So that'll be another option later on as something old to open up. Let's see here. And hopefully these videos do not take as long as our other videos. Gardevoir tin. That's why we decided to do something new, something old, and something to celebrate. So Gardevoir. Right off the top there. Ooh. Very cool card. We'll stick that right over here. And you get code card. This is an old cold card. So good luck. Hopefully you guys can redeem that online. And then we'll see what we get. Let's see what the pack selection is. We got Sun and Moon. Crimson Invasion. Burning Shadows. And Base Set. Very nice. So we got some Sun and Moon. That is a much older set. Not a much older set. But, you know, definitely a few years ago. Base Set alone came out. What was it? Base set probably came out five years ago. Maybe more, almost six years ago. So, yeah, this definitely an old set, technically. So, here we go. Let's get into it. Let's start off with the Crimson Invasion, and then we'll go into the other two. Burning Shadows, of course, 
the the chase card in that would be the Charizard code card there for the Crimson Invasion. Hopefully, once again, you'll be able to get something from those, you guys. Sun and Moon is four. Uh, I just thought maybe it wasn't. All right. X and Y is three. We got a Haunter, Sea and Nothingness, Chime Echo, Jigglypuff, Execute, Stuffle, Magikarp, Reverse Mischievous, very nice, and an Escavalier non-holographic. All right, nothing there, you guys, from this Crimson Invasion, but Crimson Invasion is one of the least light of the Sun and Moon sets, so... And that's usually why, right there. You usually don't get a whole lot from it. Let's see. Code card. Oh, Sun and Moon likes to do it differently. There you go. Sun and Moon base set. Let's see what we get. We also did a Sun and Moon opening uh, a few months ago, obviously. We did the uh, both of the ETBs. They finally came They came back out. And we were able to get a hold of both uh, sets of the ETBs. So that was a lot of fun. Surskit. Wingle. Pop Leo. Growlithe. Grubbin, a reverse Psyduck, very cool, we like Psyduck, Psyduck's cool, and a holographic Sheenautic, alright, so we got a hollow, we got a couple hollows so far, that's it you guys, so far not a whole lot to write home to mama about, alright, we got the burning shadows, like I said, Charizard is the big pull we want to get from this you guys, hopefully we can do that, we've pulled quite a few Charizards on the channel obviously, um, Charizard is the one of the most popular Pokemon out there. It is my favorite Pokemon. Of course, I grew up with the first generation, so that's why. There we go. We got a Metal Energy. Steel Energy. Whatever. Semi-Seer. Heatmore. Lana. Crabball. Crabballer, sorry. Ralts. NK. Dewpider. Tangela. Reverse Panpour and a Tangro to go with that Tangela non holographic. Alrighty, wow, that was quick and uh, quite painful. It wasn't painless, it was quite painful. Let's get that Gardevoir out. At least we can show off the Gardevoir there. You guys can take a look at it. Bam! Pretty cool card. I like it. Gardevoir. I forget what set it comes from. I, I usually can recognize it, but sometimes I can't. Alright. So, five packs of celebrations. Of course, like I said, the Rayquaza. We have yet to pull. Of course, celebrations is the 25th anniversary set from Pokemon. Came out last year. Celebrate 25 years of Pokemon. See what we get today. First pack of celebrations. Of course, the most recent special set that came out was Pokemon Go. And we did open up that. For you guys on the channel, so make sure you go take a look at those. I'll link those in the description as well. Got a lot. If we got a few videos, and I believe the card trick is oh 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 no, they goofed it up on me. So I forget where the Rayquaza. I think it's going to be in the third slot. That's why we did a quick switch. We got a Zekrom, of course. Zekrom's cool. We like Zekrom. Lugia, a Solgaleo. Let's see what we get today. We got a birthday Pikachu. Happy birthday! To Pokédad. Nah, I'm just kidding. My birthday is back in July. We didn't do a special opening. We did last year. We did a, we did a special opening for Bay Kid's birthday this year. We just, during our hiatus, my birthday hit. We didn't exactly do one. So, that's alright, though. Let's see what we can get here. We've got another pack. So, there's your celebration code card. Let's see what we get this time. Here we go. Now, I got these out of an ETB. I picked up five. Just five for the, the video, you guys, because otherwise it gets out of control. Lugia. Zamazenta V. Very nice. Zamazenta. And a Cosmoum. All right, so nothing there. We got a birthday Pikachu and a Zamazenta so far. All right. Yeah, I, I just pulled out five packs from the ETB. I didn't want to do all ten. I want to do more of a quicker video for you guys. Ten packs would get out of control. Plus, you know, got to save that for another episode of something new something old and something to celebrate so there goes code card Let's see what we get today we got another cosmog we don't want a little cosmog dialga flying pikachu v max very cool and a kai ogre of course in pokemon go you guys recently the new set pokemon go we actually just got 
uh, Kyogre, Groudon, and Dialga and Palkia. They all recently were in raids over the last couple months, or oh, month and a half, I should say. Which is nice, considering I started playing five months ago. Five months ago? Was it August? Yeah, six months ago. Okay, I've been playing Pokemon Go for six months now. And, uh, yeah, yeah, it's been, uh, it's been a lot of fun. It's a good, fun game to play. If you guys haven't, you guys should. Of course, like I said before, if you guys want, you're welcome. Oh, we got a Pikachu. Too many of these we've pulled. And a Palkia. So, uh, like I said, if you guys want to add me, uh, you guys are welcome to. Just leave a comment down below with your player code. And I will send you an invite. And then we can be friends. I'll send you some gifts. Uh, if you're ever online when I'm doing some raids, I'll definitely invite you. You're welcome to join those. Code card, of course. Last code card, last pack, you guys. Let's get some last pack magic. Here we go. Kyogre. Dialga. Let me get that on the screen there. Flying Pikachu. Now we got a lot of Pikachus here. And, oh, Cosmo. So we got almost every Pikachu you can find except for the surfing ones. But we got the VMAX, the V, Flying Pikachu, Birthday Pikachu, and a normal Pikachu. Alrighty, you guys. This was the first episode of something new, something old, and something to celebrate. If you guys like the idea, you like the episode, please let us know in the comment section down below. Of course, hit that like button. If you want to see more of this and you want to make sure you don't miss a single one, make sure you do subscribe and hit that notification bell. Alrighty, guys. Thank you so much for joining us for another episode of Bacon Pokey Dad. We'll catch you next time.